Hey everyone, welcome to your heart read and this is going to be for all the signs, okay? Uh, what? Soulmate, Twin Flames, Connections, everything, alright. Also, every link is mentioned in, in the description box below. Thank you for the support and donations and for private readings as well to book. Uh, yes, I have my Patreon now so you may go and check and join and I, I'll highly appreciate that too. Have I said? Sending love. What else? So uh, what I'm hearing is like, don't, don't go there. Okay. It's a crazy talk or a cr crazy talks. Yes. C-R-A-Z-Y-Z-Y-T-A-L-K-S. Crazy talks. I can see that happening. Like anything, everything at any moment in any given time frame with the person you are comfortable with, you people are talking makes sense doesn't make sense doesn't matter why because you people are connecting so well because you're comfortable because it doesn't affect the connection zero one 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 recording time that's what i see so so your bottom energy over here is that which is interesting is the vortex and it's a temptation to see this People just want to forget about the problems of the now. People just want to forget about what is going on. They want to be in the moment where they can talk anything, everything, at any time. Because it's, uh, it's, it's just not affecting or ruining their peace of mind. Which is like they want to be um, forgetful. They want to just live in this zone where they want to be comfortable. And I can see that. So crazy talks will release your tensions, um, even toxicity, if ever you got or received from some situation. It's like that kind of connection where people are figuring out about, okay, this, this, this we can do. It's not hurting anyone, it's not unhealthy, it is something that you are actually at peace with because that's what the best you can do for now, okay? But this is what temptation is all about. Two energies in this realm, they are in a vertex. They don't want to see what is going around or what is on the outside. They just want to be in this, okay? The vertex is taking you somewhere. So I feel like the vertex, you're just entering in the vertex knowingly. And something unusual or unusual emotions will, will happen around you. It's going to be the air, okay? Um, I feel like in this vertex, there is nothing but temptation. There is nothing or no other object is there that can hurt you. It's just air and wind, okay? That is taking you somewhere. And you're going to just go in there and land somewhere. It's kind of like the the moment, the phase where you people are enjoying, okay? And just talking and like just taking things off. Those those are hurting you or, or disappointing or whatever that is for you. Uh, people are figuring out not to look at each other, but they can't help, but they're going to look at each other. Temptation is physical. Temptation is other things. But here, I can sense this temptation is leading you to something, okay? Now, in, the, in this particular phase of temptation, in the vertex, in this zone, people are trying their level best not to touch each other. But the temptation is so strong that people are finding ways to come close to. Look, possibility. Seven of Cups, so desiring. Um, desire, physical. Can we take another word? Yes, we can, sexual. But yes, um, that's what is coming. Queen of Cups, sensitivity. Are you ready to break that, some of your particular zone of like, no, I won't? rules regulations it doesn't mean that you're just going and doing the stuff no it just means like just being talks not touching and talking uh kind of like living in the moment for a while just to get rid of the stuff or tension or something maybe talking to someone you may end up talking and this is emotional okay it's a little bit playful and all that stuff but it's sensitive your feelings are sensitive okay some of you might be dealing what's wrong with this what is this Some of you might be dealing with, or you might be the listener or the dealer, okay? Um, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. What's the second card? It doesn't make sense. 
what is making sense something is not making sense in your life right now it doesn't mean that oh why did she say that it just is like you're just in the moment <laughs> you're just you're just trying to get rid of tension that's accumulating in you right <sighs> you have the next card is justice you're going to pose as everything right or you're just fed up with putting up with things in right order sometimes you just want to make a mess of it okay it's like talk anything and you'll have someone you can talk anything with that's what i want to say like it's not a necessity necessity or your responsibility to be always in this posture of like i'm taking care it's like sometimes you need to get rid of lay back right relax and everything and i'm not going to like i'm not going to cook today for example I'm not going to do the laundry today. I'm just going to not use the broom to clean up or to fly somewhere. <laughs> okay, if you're a witch. So you're finding balance in your own self, in your own ways, finding balance for your peace of mind. Okay, not liking this. Okay, so I feel like you are genuinely impressed, first of all, by yourself. Also, there could be a Libra listening or dealing. You are right now so sensitive or in this zone or your situation is sensitive that people just want to do things in balanced mode. Some of you are entering into the phase of abstract, like feelings or something to be in that. So no one can see where she is, where he is, okay? To be away from drama. Look at this. So some of you are definitely getting into calm zone, getting into more appropriate zone, so that there's only wind or there is someone who's, why she's unreachable, why he's unreachable kind of energy, where this is like you're getting rid of drama. First of all, because of the word, Knight of Swords. You're not at all interested in quarrel or something. So you're talking with someone here, even if it doesn't make sense, you're just going to be right to yourself. If this fits you, this message is for you. I keep getting that message of, yes, vortex. Yes, something that you just want to get rid of. Yes, something that you just don't want to be. Like, I have to do it in order. Do you get this? Like, I need not to be. My priority right now, or maybe your priority right now, is to be in balance mode with yourself not with others and how much impressed they are. No, it has nothing to do with them. It is with you. You need to take care of your sensitive zone. You really need balance right now, which your way may be different. I'm going to talk to someone, okay? I'm going to uh, just give myself time. I'm going to eat something nice. I'm going to just go for a walk. Whatever you do, do. So you have seven of cups and possibility. You're figuring out chalking out a plan in your mind and in heart, of course, not telling to others, and just going with the flow, doing what you want, doing what your dream is, doing what your desire is. It's not a pressure. You are, I have to choose this cup. No, I can be with two cups. I want to drink this coffee and I want to drink this water, or I want to do this or this at the same time. On the same table, you can order two, three, four, five things you like. Like you are not interested right now that anyone should give you kind of like, you know, you should do this, but please shut the drama. That kind of energy you might be in, okay? It's not something to feel bad about. Sometimes you just need this break. And you don't want to hurt anyone. It's not that, but if someone is going to poke you, you're going to say, please give me a break. And that's what you are saying. You're in so much of authority right now, like sitting in a position and power, like people won't even mess with you, but if they do, mm -hmm. <laughs> they'll have to hear. So the words are sensitivity, balance, and possibility. Once you find balance that you will, you'll have more possibilities, okay? I can hear free will connection just to talk or something, okay? Uh, 
I heard kind of like you're looking at something or someone or thought or possibility of when they're going to catch up with you. Judgment. For me, judgment is my callback card in some times, you know, during some days. So it's a callback. You're going to hear the hear an echo. But this is a card of self-reflection. Uh, so this is also, right? I heard Sagittarius. Well, this is a card of self-reflection. Crazy talks. You don't care. You won't care. Because they never cared. So why would you? So you're going to care for yourself that you should, first of all. Because if people are self-centered, you need to be self-centered at times. Like, yes, we need to be selfish. We are not. Mm, more exploitation. Don't fall for that. Okay? Like, it's high time you decide. You prioritize. Okay? 11-11 recording time. Self-reflection is going to make, you, make for you things easy in the coming time. It's also you're on a call. You are echoing a channeling of messages with certain person here, talking anything, everything, whatever you want. And it's going to be fine. And this is some kind of temptation. But the judgment is also connected with what is that is right for you. Okay. After this moment, you're going to decide for yourself. Okay. You are connecting with energies here. You know partial, 50-50, more, whatever that is for you. During this time, you'll know all the emotions of people, how how they behave, how they talk, how you behave, how you talk to yourself and to others. So I see a lot of self-reflection time. I see you getting rid of uh, some things in your life as well. But there are crazy talks. And because of these crazy talks, because of the temptation, because of you being involved in this wind. Uh, you're going to figure out your way back home or your place or your self-satisfactory uh, uh, area or zone, okay? Something is connected with the design, D-E-S-I-G-N. Something is different, connected with design or something. Okay, two of wands energy, vision. What is your vision? You're going to be very clear about in the coming time. What is that you want the most? What is that you decide? What is that you are looking forward for? Who you are looking forward to with like situations and all? So this is what you're going to possible in the in the focused mode after all of this. You're going to know what is exactly you want. 13, 13 recording time. Uh, it's also putting an end to some things and starting new picture, new horizon. Planning preparation is coming. Okay. You'll feel in the moment of like submerged in water and emotions and talks and you know going with the flow kind of. I don't know what is that for you, but yes, I can see that. Um, crazy talks. There may be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. It could be masculine, heavy. You may be in talking terms, or you're figuring out. I feel like whoever and whatever and whichever situation is for you, personally, you people are going to definitely come out of the vertex. Definitely make better decisions and choices here. Um, like whatever is circling around, especially confusions, they are going to be uh, poured in one cup and filtered and made one. It's kind of like for some of you union or meeting with the one. But first we need to talk anything, everything with the one we want. There is this particular lady, okay, who is emotionally, is, is genuinely interested in making things right. Everything that was a vertex, everything that was bad, everything that was confusing or misunderstood. Things are going to be right in order in the coming time for you specifically, okay. You may have plans on meeting or some visit or arrival as well in the coming time. And this is the time when things are going to be manifesting on the right, right note actually, okay. 
these crazy talks might have created that lane or road of uh, thorns or concrete or something you cannot cross this the work is in process and it's been so long so something was wounded back then okay but you always had this hope that everything is going to fall at place and now everything is falling at place um five of pentacles some lost or wounded connection literally happened in this realm with you okay and this was really sensitive as well for you this connection was sensitive So the crazy talks might be uh, with the person of the past, uh, recent or distant, could be any situation connected with your timeline. But this is with the person, oh, wow, but this is with the person, that's what I was thinking, you never left hope or something. This is with the person, or oh, shut, okay, who is your soul connection somehow, could be romantic, could be just like that. But yes, yeah, soul connection. This is what you manifested in your life. You wanted everything to be sorted out. You wanted everything to be emotionally perfect, laid out. And your purpose was with love. Okay? You always wanted things to be right, in order, and peaceful. And that's what you've manifested. Something just is in front of you now. With all love. So this could be, again, romantic love or anything that is connected with your life. Okay? Also, you have the sun. Could be Leo listening or dealing. But look at this. This is a positive start, beginning, fresh. Especially after vortex and confusions and everything. Finding peace, making peace, regaining something you hoped for to make those wounds, you know. To see the wounds closely in order to heal them. And that's what I see. And you kept a lot of patience as well. So I would just want to know what is in love coming. Is there something specific, a love message today? I feel like you're going to talk with someone. Um, again, I, I still want to stick with that. It's kind of like crazy talks, like kind of. But it's okay if it doesn't make sense to them or to you or whatever, but it, it feels good. It feels good, kind of, okay? Yes, nine of pentacles. Um, I heard a kind of like somehow you're withdrawn. And with that process, you drew things to you, whatever you wanted. It's kind of law of manifestation, attraction. This is something that you are in the picture. You are entering in a room or something. But I see here a very interesting and confident talks. You shine, you walk, like, you know, someone likes you, likes your personality. You're independent, independent in work, and you love that, okay? So, you may be single, they may be single, or you're just single. I see a lot of talks, yes. A lot of talks after the pause. Um, kind of they're like they're giving the vibe of like it's time to redecorate something to get rid of anything that is not good or certain kind of temptations or some things those were confusing four of swords it's time to have the talks it's time to not just keep to self it's time to break the wall it, because the growth is very beautiful, okay? I feel like this is what you're becoming. And this is why you're becoming whatever you're becoming or you, you have become. You grew from all the turmoils or something that happened with you. You grew out of that. You have something around you which is making sense. Your work, look at this, the, the, the happiness on her face. It's different. She totally is, she totally stood out or is standing out. 
the way she was or she used to live. However, this can go on any life, okay, masculine or feminine. So this is kind of like a re-entry after the rest, after the recuperation, after healing, becoming more strong. And she is getting ready and starting to walk in the room for a beautiful or different talk or different connection or with certain someone you know getting getting rid of that and then just walking and people are like whoa look at her or look at him kind of the charm that is around you there is someone look at this people love you it's like you're meeting with kindred spirits togetherness okay um there is someone coming to talk with you they're just they're going to be drawn towards you now this could be someone new as well I feel like uh, those crazy talks might be about you as well. <laughs> In the room where you are or somewhere you are going. It's kind of like it's kind of like the connection when you are with someone and you connect and it's it's something so beautiful, charming. Why? I feel like it's time. Okay, it's time to go with the wind. You have the lovers. Uh, crazy talks might be again about you. This is very interesting. Actually, so with the lovers, could be Gemini listening or dealing. We see this, this is love. The moment you enter, you have a love interest. Or the love interest is waiting for you. And they're going to be like, wow. Like, and they're going to approach you. And I see like that. Something is very quickly happening for you. Um, new beginning, fresh start. Going with the flow, living in the moment. Getting rid of energies, those are not meant for you. It's supposed to be with you. Look at this. There's arrival, new love. Something is going to start here. The lovers, however, could be someone in relationship already, but that's a different thing, it depends. But right now I can talk about the love situation, okay? Yeah, that's it. I don't want to just, no, no. So you, something is becoming in your life, which is very interesting here. This is going to be, maybe I don't know, but this is what I heard. It's kind of like you were preparing yourself to get rid of something. Someone caused you here, okay? Let's just say that. You may be pretending, or you will. You walk in the room. This is somewhere you're being invited. And this is in someone's possible marriage or engagement, or someone is doing something. This person was involved with you but they are with someone now okay if they are getting married or in getting engaged yes and now you're getting healed okay and you are stronger and they are looking at you even they are looking at you and people are looking at you if there are common friends that are looking at you like wow you are in a loving manner going and congratulating them i don't know why you're doing this but you're doing this maybe just to get to to get over this vortex to get this to get this over this some kind of temptation possible um this this may be the way that you heal yourself okay balance yes take care and see you soon bye bye